and today we're going to be, um, so you know Coke and Mentos, obviously, we have Diet Coke and regular Coke, and we're going to be comparing them, but with a slight twist. Instead of Mentos, we're going to be using baking soda, which should work just the same, but even better, so let's try it, and then, oh, for each one, we'll also have it in slow-mo. Coke. Coke is what I like about you, everybody. So this is the, uh, normal regular Coke, Coke text on screen, so... It wasn't all actually an exact measurement, was it? Diet Coke. This one says girls just want to be fun. I think I say that one works a little bit better. Yeah. So here is the Coke bottle in slow mo. Okay, so for the second experiment, we didn't have all the ingredients for what we were going to do. So, you're going to need um, a funnel. You don't need to use one. It just makes it easier. Some vegetable oil, some food colors, <coughs> and some salt. And then just a bottle. Fill it up to about where the label was. I took it off because it looks better. So, what you're going to want to do now is choose a color. Let's just do like green. That'll be fine. Good. Just need a couple... <coughs> Because we don't want it super dark. That was pretty cool. That's my thing for it. Can you hand me the lid? Okay. That's gonna be good. Get that. Okay, so after it turns green, you can put your funnel in, get a little bit of vegetable oil, put that in. We all know it's gonna go to the top. Coolio. Big whoop, nobody cares. Yeah, we don't care about yeah. that. Okay. So, there's kind of two experiments right here. <coughs> the first one is you can get some salt. We're just going to call it one experiment. So, you can put some salt in there. It makes like a lava lamp. It falls through. Really cool. Bubbles will continuously come up. That's it's better if you use some alcohol seltzer and some other stuff. But, but it's that's a cool experiment, right? Yeah. Now, what you can do, too, is just get a different color food coloring and put a couple drops in there, and it kind of goes through the... It's very slow. Look at that. It goes right through there, and it pops like that. Isn't that so cool? Yeah. Watch this, guys. Look at that. That's a cool experiment. Very simple, but very cool. So now we're going to be exploding some bottles, and I'll see you guys in the next experiment. Safety first for this next experiment. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to, this is like the flame bottle. This is a cool experiment. So you're going to just get a glass bottle. Don't make it plastic. Make sure you get just a little bit of alcohol. Make sure when you pour your alcohol, put it far away from the fire. Betsy, would you take that? Take the alcohol. Now what you want to do is put your, a lid on the bottle or something. Just kind of spin it around to get the alcohol to just like line the sides a little bit. Now, take a match. Match. Match, match, match.com. Whoa. Isn't that cool? I didn't see it. Now, we'll cut the video. If you guys did enjoy that video, just remember to let that like button, share the video, and subscribe to the family. Yeah. Subscribe, you filthy animal.